Tetrazoline, in, also known as tetrahydrazoline, a drug used in some over-the-counter eye drops and nasal sprays. Pharmaceutical action Tetrazoline is an alpha agonist for alpha-2 receptor and imidazoline receptor I1 agonist. Mainly due to its alpha-2 agonism it can constrict conjunctival blood vessels of the eye when taken in the form of eye drops. This relieves the redness of the eye caused by minor ocular irritants. To treat allergic conjunctivitis, tetrazoline can be combined in a solution with antizoline. In an overdose, slow heart rate and low blood pressure are mainly due to imidazoline-1 receptor agonism. Dry mouth and sedating effects are due to alpha-2 agonism. Side effects Tetrazoline eye drops may cause blurred vision, eye irritation and dilated pupils. Tetrazoline is not suitable for prolonged use as its vasoconstrictive effects within the eye eventually decrease or stop. When body is accustomed to tetrazoline, ceasing its use may cause redness of the eyes. Intranasal use of tetrazoline may cause transient burning, stinging, or dryness of the mucosa and sneezing. Prolonged intranasal use often causes opposite effects in the form of rebound congestion with effects such as chronic redness, swelling and rhinitis. Prolonged use thus may result in overuse of the drug. Overdose most often causes slow heart rate. Respiratory depression, low blood pressure, constricted pupils, hypothermia, brief episodes of high blood pressure, drowsiness, headaches and vomiting may also occur. In serious cases some of these effects may result in circulatory shock. Most often overdoses occur in children who have ingested the drug. There is no antidote for tetrazoline or other similar imidazoline analog poisoning, but the symptoms can be alleviated and with treatment, death is rare. Pharmacokinetics Half-life of tetrazoline in healthy people is about 6 hours and it is excreted unchanged in urine, at least in part. In one study 10 people were given 2 drops of 0.5 mg per milliliter tetrazoline eye drops 0.025 to 0.05 mg at 0, 4, 8 and 12 H. Within 24 hours time window since the last dose, tetrazoline blood serum concentration of the subjects was 13.0 to 210.0 ng per milliliter and urine concentration was 11 to 400 ng per milliliter. Both reached their maximum about 9H post last dose. These levels correspond to normal ocular use of tetrazoline. Higher concentrations may indicate misuse of the drug or poisoning. Chemistry Chemically, tetrazoline is a derivative of imidazoline. It has two enantiomers. Urban legend an urban legend suggests that tetrazoline can cause violent diarrhea if given orally, such as by putting a few drops of visine in an unsuspecting person's beverage. However, the actual results of the prank may be worse, varying from severe nausea and vomiting to seizures or a coma. Diarrhea is not a side effect. Criminal use in late August 2018, a South Carolina woman, was charged with murdering her husband by putting eye drops containing tetrazoline his drinking water. An autopsy found high concentrations of tetrazoline in his body. Tetrazoline has been used as a date rape drug in a number of cases due to its ability to cause dizziness and unconsciousness. In popular culture Tetrazoline was used as a plot device in the 1990 film The Spirit of 76. Time travelers from the year 2176, where tetrazoline is a rare commodity, have traveled back to 1976 and have to use tetrazoline eye drops, a common item in 1976, as part of a battery in a time machine in order to return to the future. The 2005 film Wedding Crashers includes the use of eye drops containing tetrazoline to poison a person's drink. In Season 4, Episode 4, Dr. Psycho, of Netflix's Orange is the New Black, the character Galina Red Reznikov is alleged to have contaminated another inmate's food with an eye drop topical solution containing tetrazoline. This results in that inmate almost immediately running to a porta potty toilet and enduring violent diarrhea due to the poisoning. 
References